It's the first day of school. Hooray! Are you excited? Sure. sure. You're excited. I can tell. Because you could get sleep till what, midnight? Or so. <laughs> to uh, make some keys for that uh, that lock I installed uh, yesterday. There's not enough keys for the tenant, so we're going to get some more made. I'm going to go to Tucky's to do that. They're pretty good at that. It's a key. How hard can it be? TSC. Look, I got turkeys. I think that's a rabbit. Geese. A fox. I'm here for a class or a hasp. I found my cooler. It says it's the cooler I've always wanted. And the last one I'll ever need. Hmm. Only two seventy nine. Okay, that was uh, TSC. Wanted to pick up a hasp, a locking hasp. Now I'm going to pop by Lori's Fasteners, pick up some fasteners, and then uh, then where am I going? Oh, the yacht club to pick up that uh, <laughs> fiberglass resin. It's raining. Why not, eh? Why wouldn't it rain? I always use a good rain. Not when I get a fiberglass, though. So. We'll see. I don't know if I'll be able to fiberglass it today. Look, it's raining. I'm at the Yacht Club. I'm just going to take a little peek at my dock, see if it's still here. I haven't seen it. Oh, look, it's still here. And it's floating. Wow, that's the first time it's been floating in a long time. And look at that green soup. <laughs> oh my. Lovely, lovely green algae. Nice. There's Spotty. Good job, Spotty. He doesn't keep sticks away or logs away, but keeps the, uh, the other birds away. Okay. In my birdhouse. Looks like a spider's moved in. That's fine. Okay, I'm here to pick up my uh, fiberglass resin out of the McGregor. So let's do that. Nice. Just what I want to see. Nice dry boat. <sighs> okay, let's, uh, let's find that fiberglass resin. There's a lot of boats on the hard here. Everybody's pulling out before, uh, I guess this 17th is when they're gonna lower the lake. So, got a couple, well, a couple of weeks, say it's the fourth, so we don't quite have a couple of weeks. No, we, yeah, a little less than two weeks. Oh well, we're off to see Brian at Call the auto now. Go get my car. So I got uh, a few things out of the boat. I got my axe and a lawn chair, uh, both for the next weekend. There'll be a bunch of guys camping on shore this uh, coming weekend, and uh, nobody brought an axe last year except for me. 
So, bring in the axe so we'll be able to have a bonfire. I didn't find my <laughs> fiberglass resin. That's crazy. I don't know what I've done with this stuff. It's got to, I must have put it in the cupboard or someplace. As I haven't checked the cupboards, I usually leave it out on the shelf. We'll take a look in the cupboard, see if that's what I've done with it. Just dropped the XC90 off at the, uh, the Waldorf School. I almost set up the Yacht Club. Right. Anyways, I'm going to walk down to Brian's and uh, grab the car. I think I know where I'm having lunch. It's a great idea, Pierros. Well, I'm in the V50. Just called Volvo. Volvo doesn't have my spring yet, so we're gonna go without a spring for a day. It'll be in tomorrow, they said. We're back home. Brought the car in the driveway, and I've already used penetrating oil on the uh, the bolts and the nuts that I'll have to get at in the next. Uh, next day or so, I'm going to be replacing a spring. Uh, I may as well do it. Save me a hundred bucks anyways. So, uh, it'll probably take an hour. Hopefully it'll be in tomorrow, and if it is, I'll get it done. Then, now, back to my fiberglassing. Where is that? Isn't it odd that I, I can't find something in all this mess? <laughs> Man, what have I done with this stuff? Ah, uh, the last I saw it, I had it in a big white bucket. Like that one. But, it's not in a big white bucket. I'm going to check up here. Found it. Ah, uh, I thought this was just the box of... of uh, cloth, but no, the resin was in the bottom. So, now it's a matter of just washing under there with acetone. I've already cut up some chunks and uh, getting to it. I'm going to get under the boat now and uh, wash that spot with uh, acetone. Okay, that's washed. I'm gonna let that dry for a little bit and uh, get to putting our farmer glass in. Okay, so I've mixed my my fiberglass resin. I'm just going to paint it on. I've pre-cut these so to make them so much easier to use if I could get hard. There we go. away and uh, that's it. That's how you fix your the hole in your siren's hull. These gloves off. Oh 
man, that's warm. Bye, sweetie pie. Bye. Thanks, you too. Love ya. Fiberglass shard. I'm gonna wipe down my arm again with the uh, acetone just uh, because it's sticky. And then I'm gonna go in and wash it up with soap and water. I guess ideally you're not supposed to get acetone on your yourself, but it's the only way I know how to get fiberglass off. And fiberglass gets itchy or sticky and starts to burn. Okay. Inside to wash up. Your new hat. Oh, uh, I'm sure it's nice. I just can't look at it right now. I'm washing my stuff. What happened? Oh, I just got I got some fiberglass on me. Mm -hmm. So you want to get that stuff off right away. There we go. Spunky can. That's got that. Oh, we've got a few other things we gotta just wrap up quick. I'm gonna roll this up. I want to get in the boat and get my sleeping bags out to air them out. Uh, just so make sure that they're dry and ready to go for this weekend. Here we go. Okay, uh, got to figure out how much water to bring. I'm going for Friday night, Saturday night. I think I'll bring a couple of these. Uh, at least a couple of these. For the water, and I've got one here, full, and uh, I can fill this one up. What else do I need? I've got chargers. Glasses, toque, good to go. So one of the last things I need to do is just take some pictures of this for the uh, Siren group, post them. There it is there. It's uh, not pretty, but it's going to work fine. If I wanted to, I could sand that down after I make, make it uh, nice and smooth, but yeah. I don't really care about that. I'll hit it with bottom paint next year. Wow, that's hard to focus on. <laughs> These are the sleeping bags. I just brought them in to air them out. They're dry, but I thought I'd bring them in. Tomorrow, we're going to check our uh, job by filling the boat with water and see if in, seeing if it leaks out be fun anyways i'm gonna wrap it up here thanks for watching please click the clicky things and uh, give a thumbs up for fixing the boat <laughs>